everybody, I'm Sherry. I am low carbon keto on a budget. I do weekly grocery budget hauls. I do weekly meal preps. I do what I eat and I do in the month of August. I am vlogging for Vlogist. Um, not been a great week. I have been so incredibly busy. I have not eaten clean this week. It's been really bad. I am up three pounds. I'm at 224. I'm up three pounds since my lowest weight earlier this week. And I sure is because I'm not fasting and I've not fasted well and I've not been eating clean this week. So my body is protesting. And this, uh, where I hit the this, this sun the other day, I was fine yesterday, although I know I said I was suffering, but I really wasn't. Um, Today, I am in a lot of pain up here from the sun. The sunburn is just it's hurting. I had some um, Young Living Rose ointment that I put on there, which has relieved it. I'm going to put some aloe on it again later as soon as I get home. Right now, I'm on my way to pick up my son's friend, and they're going to spend the day together. So, my son will be busy, and so will I, because I have a ton of work to do on the computer. I have to get my client's newsletters done and out. Um, I know I won't get them done today, but I, there's one of them that I absolutely have to get done. My goal is to get them by the 10th. It's the 8th now, so I've got, except for the ones that are communicative with me, I get those out as quickly as possible, and I've got one of those left to do, so my goal is to get that one done, and possibly another one done. And another goal is to get freaking paid by the ones who have not paid me yet that are that were due on the first. I have one that still owes me from last month. Um, I'm working my way to get out of this business. I'm tired of chasing down clients for to get paid. And the ones that are paying me on time, I can't compete with the bigger companies, so I'm losing them to the ones that had the all the bells and whistles and the fun stuff, and they did the text messaging stuff. And for me, and, and the video messaging stuff, for me, it is way too expensive to get into that when I just, I can't. I mean, I may just start doing a newsletter service, because. Technically, to be honest, most of my clients are just newsletters at this point. So, but I've got two of them that just stress me to no end. So, I'm working my way to getting out of doing that. Um, I haven't done any Instacart shops this week. I did just discover that I have been approved for ship, so I'm going to be switching over to shipped because I think that one is going to be a higher pay and I'm hoping that it's going to keep me busier because Instacart is just, there's way too many shoppers in this area and the competition to get the shops are just, it's just unreal. I had one pop up today, I live outside of Knoxville, I had one pop up today for Oak Ridge, they wanted me to drive all the way to Oak Ridge to go to an Aldi for seven bucks. No, it takes, it'll take me more than seven bucks in gas to do that. So that's not going to happen. I had nothing pop up, pop up from my area all week. That could change tomorrow. Usually Friday and Saturdays are pretty busy days and I may have a couple of them pop up tomorrow which will be great. Although I have a leadership training at church tomorrow night so I can do stuff during the day but it's just I need a day off. Come on man. It's like every day I've been running, but Sunday I'm taking the day off from volunteering at church. I, my husband and I, we're going to take a trip up to the mountains, so I will be filming that. And it's just, it's going to be beautiful up there, and I'm really looking forward to just getting away from the house and the daily responsibilities of everything with my husband and my son, and just having a good time. Looking forward to that. I'm holding out some cash for our trip. We may go, probably will go out to eat somewhere. What I'll probably do is I'll pack some snack foods and some stuff, some drinks and snack foods and stuff, and we may go out to eat. There's a Mel's Diner in Pigeon Forest that I wanted to go try out. So I'm going to go check that out online. 
I thought that really looked interesting. And we may hit up Publix while we're out there too in Pigeon Forge because, yeah, Publix. I love Publix. We'll have to see what's on sale this week. Although I was there the other day, I really didn't do a whole lot of shopping around. Um, I'm planning on trying to get some surveys done today, trying to get some newsletters done today. I need some more Amazon gift cards. So I'm trying to work on getting those done. I should have from... I was just at Kroger's. I got a few things at Kroger's. Spent 61 bucks there. I got some of the Jimmy Dean Simply Scramble stuff. My husband loves that stuff. It wasn't on sale, but it was a good price. And plus I didn't, I bought a thing back for that. So I got my husband a couple of those. I got me one of those protein packs, Jimmy Dean protein packs. It has egg and Colby sausage and ham in it low carb so I'm probably gonna have that for lunch today and again I bought a thing back for that too that was a good price and let's see what else did I get oh Kroger's gave me gave me a coupon for a free pack of Jimmy Dean sausage so my husband's favorite is to say sausage so I snagged a pack of those and it sent me now I know that's not keto but it sent me a coupon for a free um, Betty Crocker, it's Betty Crocker, anyway, cake mix, um, but I will use that for when I, you know, I bake something for an event like church, my home group or something like that, they love my snickerdoodle cupcakes, so I usually like to take something for them that's not keto and then I'll take something else that is, is keto friendly and I'm slowly working them over to the side of the light trying to wean them away from the dark side of sugars and carbs so and one way to do that is to take them something nice or something sweet that's not keto and then take them something keto and show them the difference that they can have good stuff on keto so that being said that was free and the Jimmy Dean sausage was free because I had coupons for those and then I picked up a couple of the rain that around the rain energy drinks they were on sale two for three so I got a couple of those and I got my son some kind bars and a couple of boxes of cliff bars for my husband and then I grabbed some a few they had some power crunch bars individual that were on sale they never had the kind I like in the box had to hit up Target for that because I think Target has them in the box. Some of my favorites and that's the um, chocolate mint and the red velvet are my absolute favorites. Although I love the peanut butter fudge ones too but yeah. Anyway um, I am almost to the house where my son's friend is and I see him down there so I'm going to check off and I will see you guys next time. Bye.